Empire Today versus State Farm. This is Duke versus North Carolina. What's up, you're watching Hive Mind, the most nautical show on the internet. My name is Riley, as always, by my nonsensical co-host, Graydon. <laughs> it does do that, right, and then you twist it. <laughs> <laughs> and today we're lucky enough to be joined by our friend, content creator, singer, songwriter, and avid Funko Pop collector, Gabby, Gabby Bell. Bell. Yes, that's me, Gabby Balls, and I actually, it's actually Legos, but it's fine. <laughs> today we're eating a handful of earworms. This is our... Commercial Jingles Bracket. Balls. So 64 of the catchiest commercial jingles. We're gonna rank them March Madness style. Me, Gabby, and Graydon all get a vote. Only one can win. Just like, wait, okay, I rank, I do my March Madness brackets based on the logos of the teams. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's a good idea. So. So that's totally what I'm gonna, yep. Before we get into it, make sure you like the video. Subscribe if you wanna see more. HiveMindTV.com for our merch. We've also got other merch that's on the screen right now. It's linked in description. Patreon, Cameo, linked in description. Thank you, everybody out there. And subscribe to Gabby Bell's channel. Please. Okay, yeah, I guess. Oh, you don't want them to? That's fine. All right, we'll be right back after these messages. <laughs> see what I did there? <laughs> you see what I did there? Yeah, we're good. Uh -huh. 64 commercial jingles. In the first round, we're gonna hear a small clip of each of them. Are you ready? Got yes. It. Get your $5 at Chicken Wing House for $10 chicken hot crispy wings at Wing House. What's that commercial? W -w -wing Maybe it's House. Arby's. <laughs> it might be Arby's. First matchup is McDonald's versus Sockum Boppers. Oh. Where is Sockum Boppers? Like what happened to them? Is no, that what like you mean? where are they? Like what, where do they exist in the world? Uh, like basements, like. Oh, like, no, like, <laughs> mostly <laughs> Toys R Us. Okay. Oh, okay. Walmart. Okay. Yeah. Is that the original? Sounds like it. That wow. was like, it sounded old. It yeah. did not sound like ba da ba ba ba. I'm, I'm loving, loving it. it. It was like 1930s. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. I'm loving it. It was a little groove. That one was written by Pusha T and Pharrell, though. Yeah. <laughs> Allegedly. Allegedly. I like right. the little groove. I'm feeling it. It's all right. I think I need to hear Sockum Boopers first yeah. before judging. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> All right. Yeah. Suck them yeah. boopers. <laughs> suck them boppers. Suck them boppers. More fun than a pillow fight. Holy shit. <laughs> More fun than a pillow fight. That one really goes for it. You yeah. know, McDonald's is a little shy. I think sock and boppers are like, let's fucking go. Yeah, like <laughs> it's a here. party. It's a party and we're here to sock them boppers. <laughs> See, <laughs> this ready. is a fun bracket because the one seed is for sure McDonald's here. Right. And the 16 seed is pulling a St. Vincent, St. Mary. Yeah. Whoever did it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Whoever did the upset thing. Great. Yeah. Like, I think, I think sock and boppers wins. It's like a little bit more, more conviction. Yeah. Really yeah. It's like an upset when yeah. my parents got divorced. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah. It's my fault. Oh, was it? Yeah, it was my no. fault. Oh. Yeah. It's okay. Thanks. You'll be all right. <laughs> <laughs> I think Sock and Boppers wins here too. For people that don't know what Sock and Boppers are, they're big giant balloons that you'd stick on your hands and you'd punch your friends. Yeah. Yeah. Down goes Ronald. Light Bright versus Oscar Mayer. Okay, what Ooh. the fuck is Light Bright? <laughs> oh, Light Bright is the, okay. It's like an LED light okay. type thing, but you plug in these little pegs that light up different colors and you make like a picture. So each peg okay. is like a different color and there's like a screen in front of the LED and you can plug them in and so you can do, you know, make this, your little designs. Mm -hmm. Is this like a Michigan thing, like squirt? Just like 90s <laughs> toys. <laughs> Wait, squirt only happens in Michigan? Yeah, we don't have squirt anywhere else. Light bright, light bright, make a face to glow at night. Ooh. 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 I love the toms there. Yeah, <laughs> wow. <laughs> yeah, had a nice ass on it. it was, yeah, yeah it was well thought out. Wiener time. What the <laughs> fuck? <laughs> it's like they took the first kid they saw off the street and it was like, do it. <laughs> Sing, idiot. He didn't even learn the it. melody. He was just, yeah. No retakes. It really does you feel like a home recording of somebody who became a pop star. Yeah. They're like, yeah. look at their humble beginnings. Look yeah. at little Huddy. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> this, this was little Huddy before fame. Yeah, look, at you, look at young Chase. Just yeah. banging around on pots and pans and singing about wieners. That's awesome. That one <laughs> takes a cake. That, I'm voting for Oscar Mayer. I'm with you there. Light Bright's a little forgettable. First name Oscar, last name Mayor. Like a sprained ankle boy, ain't nothing, nothing to, to play, play with. with. Oh. Yeah. Now we got Folgers versus Chia Pet. This one's easy for me. I haven't heard Folgers, Folgers, <laughs> Folgers, <laughs> Fall Guys. The best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup. God. That was a little 70s 
sexy. Oh, <laughs> it was kind of sexy. Wayne Brady in a robe. Yeah, that song rocks. It's a, it's a good. Maybe if I drink coffee, maybe it would hit different. I'm a big tea girl. Okay. Well, you're a tea channel, right? Yeah, I am a drama tea channel. You know, nice. I mainly <laughs> cover drama. You know, deaf noodles and Hassan probably. You know, <laughs> probably <laughs> one of all, these days. It's all on there. <laughs> <laughs> That's awesome. It was less than a second. Yeah. <laughs> That's it. As much as I love Chia because I do think that the, the jingle represents the growing. Like it has like yeah. a Chia. Yeah, it shows like a bit of a time lapse. It'd be like Chia. Yeah. It's full growth. It, it, yeah. It, there's a lot of like cool things about it, but I can't deny that catchy. Sexy, sultry little melody from Holger's. I know. I, I hate to agree, but I agree. It's an American classic. You're in a robe, two hands on the mug, Both. and the steam yeah. is like soaking your face. Yeah. The best part of waking up is Folgers in your cup. Now we got Bounty versus Alka Seltzer. <laughs> Never heard of any of these. Oh, Bounty's the. The quicker picker up. The quicker pick. Yep. Uh, I didn't know they had a jingle. It's a quilted quicker picker up. Okay. Oh my bad. Yeah, it's right. the quilted technology that sets it apart from other flimsy paper towels. Right. Oh no, yeah, that's my that's my fault. Yeah. The quilted quicker picker up bounty. Wow, there was a lot of notes in that. Okay. The quilted quicker picker upper, it's bounty. <laughs> that was like a, a musical theorist major did yeah. that one. They were like, I want to fucking be unique and cool. Alka seltzer, plop, plop, fizz, fizz. Oh, what a relief it is. That's awesome. It's because as they're dropping them in, they go plop, plop, plop do, and then they fit. Do, plop, that sounds plop, like plop, something plop. like an elf from Rudolph would sing or something. <laughs> it is. Yeah. Is it claymation? Yeah, their mascot's like a little elf. Oh, really? And he's got like a wand and he's like plop, plop, fizz, fizz. Bounty seems pretentious to me. I kind of agree. <laughs> like, Are we going to go with all these sloppy little children's tunes? <laughs> I, the children, well, they're great for ads. Those yeah. crazy ad maniacs figured that out a long time yeah. ago. Yeah, not for me. Silly little kids and silly little dogs. That's what sells. Mm -hmm. that's You're not what selling sells. me shit from a kid. I'm sorry. No. Well, Fuck that kid. Would you rather take a pretentious <laughs> paper towel brand with some muscular guy with flannel on the on the fucking packaging? Yeah. That's brawny. Uh, oh, fuck. Yeah, <laughs> well. yeah. I would, though. Okay, so you guys are going Alka-Seltzer? Yeah. I'm going I'll put my vote in for Bounty, but it doesn't matter. Hey. Mm -hmm. And now we got the General versus Goldfish. Is the General like the insurance with, with the little animation guy? Go to the General save some time. It's that. That's awesome. For a great no rate you can get online, go to the general and save some time! <laughs> Oh, wow. That's aggressive. Yeah. It's a shredding guitar I that I never noticed. <laughs> There's a guy back there like... <laughs> <laughs> the sleepy guitar solo happening behind the jet. Yeah, yeah, Is it a motorcycle good. or a car at the, at the end? It's a car? Yeah. <laughs> this is one of those ones where the more you listen to it, the more you can appreciate the art. Yep. Yeah. yeah. The snack that smiles back. Goldfish. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, it's not goldfish. taking the general down for me. I'm going with the general. But the goldfish is a snappy little jingle. I kind of got to go goldfish. Goldfish. I love oh, when a jingle shit. ends by saying just goldfish. like, yeah. Like you can imagine the guy in the studio saying this. Goldfish. <laughs> goldfish. He had to make the face too, or else it didn't happen. <laughs> They're like, we got the singer at the beginning. <laughs> yeah. He's coming in from four to five. He's gonna sing the part that goes, the snack that smiles back. And then we've got another guy coming in from five to six. Yeah. He's gonna go, goldfish. Goldfish. <laughs> this is a tough one yeah. for me. Because <clears throat> the general is just so aggressive and in your face. Mm -hmm. And it's like, it's there. What's yours? I can't do this. I'm Too leaning boring. goldfish. You're leaning goldfish. Yeah. I probably have to go with a general. That, that's that's mine. That's all right. You My guys are stomach. slaves to the uh, military industrial <laughs> complex. <laughs> yeah, that's really Aren't we why, all, you know. Right? Amen, brother. Now we got Rice Krispies versus Ricola. Ricola with the fugal horn. That's what it's called, right? Yeah. They just added that to Minecraft. Are these like old lady candies? Ricola? They're they, not candies. What are they? Cough drops. Oh, yeah, yeah. Old lady candies. Yeah. Yeah, I guess. <laughs> Snap, crackle, rice Nobody knows that shit. Yep. I, all I know is the snap, crackle, pop. Wait, no, that's something else. No, that's right. Yeah. That's right. Snap, crackle, pop. That sounded old as fuck and I've never heard it in my life. Me <laughs> yeah. It has like a little xylophone in it. <laughs> I kind of like it. Yeah, oh, I mean, sounds like someone's farting, and I like it. Yeah, me too. <laughs> That's good. I never knew that was even a jingle, and people just say that. Oh, no, no, it's a Ricola. thing. I just thought yeah, that was it's a like thing. A, honestly, I thought that was some shit. Yeah, people said at soccer it has games. staying power. You know what I mean? You know, I, I guess you could. You know, it goes beyond a jingle. Yeah, and that Rice Krispies thing is not selling me cereal. I don't know. Me neither. You know? No. All right, now we got Mr. Clean versus Farmers Only. Ooh, Ooh we're this is gonna be a tough one. Mr. Clean will clean your whole house and every room that's in it. Mr. Clean, Mr. Clean, Mr. 
It sounds like a Lumineers. What? Yeah, that was nice. Yeah. I didn't know that was the. I didn't really? know the jingle. I know the bald guy and what he looks yeah. like, and I like that. <laughs> Wow. Uh, at the end, he goes, city folk just don't get it. <laughs> oh, really? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> oh, my gosh. Oh. Do you remember this commercial? No. <laughs> I it, lived in a city. <laughs> yeah, it's true. It might be just a Midwest <laughs> thing. It starts off, there's like two cows talking to each other, and it's like, where's Elaine? And the oh, other one's like, wow. she's out walking the fields again. She's so lonely. She's for the streets. Yeah, she's for the streets. <laughs> <laughs> But it is just a, it's a dating site for rural folk. For farmers only. Yeah. That's something I can't yeah. relate to, but I respect. Yeah, I'm going farmers only. That's incredible. I don't know. I, I like both. I hate the Mr. Clean one. I hope it. Okay, I don't hate. I, mean, I think I'll go Mr. Clean to be contrarian. I like, okay, I like that. Yeah. Farmers. Okay. Okay. All right. That, that's fine. That's fine. I can I get can't, behind it. I can't turn my back on my people. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Old Spice Ooh. versus Stanley Steamer. Oh, it's going to be a toughie. It's just so satisfying nice. though. It's just Terry Crews. It's Terry you know? Crews, but like <laughs> also, <laughs> like a, it's like a pirate ship sort of vibe. There's yeah. something kind like really is. nautical yeah. about it. Mm -hmm. right. Isn't Old Spice thing like a ship too? I think it is. Oh yeah, A it little is. sailboat? Yeah. And there's something about that tone of the whistle that feels clean. Wow. Yes. Oh, Can't beat I'm that. here for it. Yeah. That's like the one I thought That's of when of I knew heart. we were doing this. Yeah. I'm here for Stanley. He can steam my carpets. I'm going to just get my vote out there for Old Spice because I think it's so clean and so crisp. Yeah, I. it's very, very close for me, but I am going to go Stanley. Now we got J.G. Wentworth <laughs> versus Bud Light. Oh, boy. This is a tough one because I know the Bud Light jingle we chose, and it's not It's not just your everyday one. Oh, I'm overwhelmed. <laughs> I feel like if I don't choose this bank, I'm gonna get shot. <laughs> like, oh, Who is this, Lay Miz? <laughs> What's going on? You go to church, you choose this bank. JG Wentworth! <laughs> What? Real man of genius. So what about like that? Don't you understand? Peter Cetera on this <laughs> track. Like, are we in Chicago? What's going on? It's like a one of their random ad campaigns. Yeah, it was like a two year campaign, maybe like early 2010s. It was just about these guys that were geniuses because they chose to drink Bud Light. If drinking a Bud Light makes you a real man of genius, I was a, a real genius 16 times last night. <laughs> this is like, I'm an old man on a boat in a rocking chair on the boat. <laughs> type like Bud Light thing. Yeah. Like, I don't know if I, as a youngin, you know, I think Bud Light's trying to expand to the young crew and this yeah. this isn't doing it for me. No. Mm -hmm. Boo, Gen Z. J.G. Wentworth is going to be tough to beat. Yeah, that yeah. was a full orchestra. J.G. Wentworth? Yeah. Zoo Pals versus FreeCreditReport.com. Oh, yes. Buzz, buzz, Zoo Pals. Quack, quack, Zoo Pals. Zoo Pals make eating fun. Yeah, that's... That's great. No, I like that one. No, <laughs> well, whew, sorry. it's wonderful. Yeah, I, it made me want the plate. <laughs> That's all zoo pals are, right? Yeah, the plates. <laughs> plates that look like little fun farm little critters. animals. Yeah. Yes. And that was supposed to make it more appealing to children. Yeah. Why not? Out of an ear of a tiger. It seems sadistic. It's the ear of the tiger, <laughs> and I'm eating my nuggets, yeah. and it's yummy in my mouth, and there's an animal. I'm just picturing like <laughs> a, a little pig plate, and yeah. they're like, "Here's your like, bacon, honey." Oink, zoo pal. So? Murder, murder. See? Oink, oink. Yeah. yeah that's right. A, Seems a little sadistic. You know how people have like a voice that they talk to animals in? Yeah. Yes. Like they're like, oh, here you go, buddy. Like that whole thing. This is the voice that you sing to children to sell them stuff. And that to makes me sick. To sell them bacon. Sick. Like yeah. the oink. Oink, zoo pals. Like nobody talks like that. Nobody sings like that except when they're singing to four year olds. Like yeah. a normal guy walked in there and was like, dude, I'm doing some weird shit for zoo pals today, blah, blah, blah. blah. And they're like, yeah, get on there. And he's like, oink, oink, <laughs> zoo pals. Like, it's just awful. You should have gone to freecreditreport.com. I could have seen this coming at me like an atom bomb. Is wow. this okay. Flight of the Concords? <laughs> you know what I mean? Doesn't it sound yeah. like Flight of the Concords a little bit? Yeah. He's on a horse. 
Yeah. I can't believe there was a time where you people were advertising just to get your credit score for free. Yeah. How yeah. hard was it to fucking get your credit score in 2006? There's a paywall. It's crazy. It's like if they made you pay for your report card. Well, they kind of, never mind. Yeah, they do. That's absurd. They, they just put money on everything in this country. It is they a damn down, yeah. shame. Yeah. It is a damn God, goddamn shame. this generation shame. on their phones. And that is why I ain't having kids unless it's an accident. Screenagers. Yeah. iPhone, iPad, how about some eye contact? Yeah. Oh. Empire Today versus State Farm. Oh, a battle of the classics. Ooh. This is Duke versus North Carolina. 800-588-2300, Empire. Today. I didn't know there was a today after that. Yeah. <laughs> That's like the today. jingle to end all jingles. And they kind of just threw in the today, though, without any thought. There. So it's a plus for Goldfish, but all of a sudden when it's, when it's Empire <laughs> Today, you wish it had just yeah, been Empire be whenever? Yeah, because they were like, today. Like, it was an afterthought. <laughs> yeah, there I feel like, you. I think there's something to be said, though, when the jingle has the number. True. That's brilliant. And you remember it? Yeah, yeah. I, we all remember it. Like, if I needed to call Empire, I got it. And I mm -hmm. literally can only remember, like, five phone numbers. 8675309. Well, you never forget. 911. 1-8-8-5-8-8 Building 7 Went down a Y <laughs> <laughs> It's classic Yeah It's one of the more recognizable ones But uh, I don't know There's something about insurance companies Yeah it's true <laughs> Like Nationwide is on your side Spoiler alert. That one's pretty Ooh, good, though. That's yeah. true. And they get a bunch of celebrities to do it. Mm -hmm. This one's cool because you remember the words even when they're not there. Like a good neighbor, mm -hmm. State Farm is there. That's true. I'm going to Empire on this one. I think I agree. That choir yeah. of angels. Yeah, I can't <laughs> beat that. Sorry, Jake. All right, now we got Clorox versus Chili's Baby Back Ribs. Wow. Ooh, I know what's All winning right. here. Yep. Mama keeps our house clean with the magic. Mama's got the magic of... Wow. You know what? I like that. Yeah. That's kind of nice. This is a little tropical. Yeah. Yeah. That's like a, a goddamn Paloma. Yeah, it is know? like a goddamn Paloma a little bit. It like yeah. tastes like a goddamn Paloma Who's to me. Paloma? Who's Paloma? I don't like how this sounds like a vacation tune and it's about like just clean, like just domestic clean, yeah. life. That's, That's true. true. That Mama true. keeps the house <laughs> lively <laughs> and clean. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's like, yeah. It's like yeah. read the room. Chili's baby back ribs. I want my baby back Chili's baby back ribs. <laughs> <laughs> you guys have to know how hard we're laughing because it just is so much louder than anything else we've heard today. It was just so loud. Like, oh my god. Raw, raw at the Chili's concert. Like, this what is this fucking shit? This wouldn't hit the same if there wasn't the baby bug, baby bug, baby right. bug, baby bug. Like, it doesn't hit the same if it was just a regular bass. That's yeah. all I remember yeah. is baby back, baby back, baby back. I don't remember the song on top of it at all. Chili's yeah. baby back ribs. Barbecue sauce. <laughs> <laughs> just for the baby back, I like that more, but yeah. the Clorox one kind of got me, charmed me a little bit. I yeah. don't know. I'm still with Baby Bag because there's something just nice about an unassuming part of the jingle just taking the charm all the way to the moon, mm -hmm. like Dogecoin. I just love the effort, too. They're like, these are guys in a studio. Yeah. There's Jeez, some dudes. Baby Bag Ribs. Also, the video yeah. jingle for one item on their menu is right. funny. Yeah. yeah. You know, there's a few of those on here, but that is always funny to me. Yeah. So Chili's, <laughs> they don't have a jingle, but we're Making one for the ribs. Yeah. <laughs> want those. Yeah, we'll go ribs on it. Now we got. Oh, there we go. <laughs> go Nationwide is on Hive Mind. Wow. Nationwide is on your side. It is a classic one. I didn't like the John Legend, Legend rendition. <laughs> yeah. He did it? Yeah, he did. For he COVID? Did it? Probably. Oh, okay. <laughs> Word. He usually just sings stuff for tragedies, I thought. Yeah. Yeah, probably. Just like his marriage. Sad. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> Talk about hey, tea. tea. Let's go. Let's go, Gabby. All of me <laughs> and Chrissy. Tea. <laughs> Get in the zone. Auto zone. Wow. Quick. I love an auto zone. They're always like kind of horsing around in there. Yeah, they're kind of horsing around. There's just a bunch of car parts in there that I don't know what to do with. Mm -hmm. I love the smell too. Yeah, it does smell it good. It smells like tire. car. Yeah. yeah, like good tire, like not used tire. Right. right. That fresh rubber. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> I'm going nationwide on this though. I'm an auto zone guy. <laughs> oh no, it's up to me. It's up to you. John Legend or windshield wiper guy. <laughs> oh no. I have to go with windshield wiper guy. I have to... Right. I have to, I have to. Chrissy Teigen's tweets are bad. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Next we got Education Connection versus Red Robin. Ooh, Ooh, wow. Two very different juggernauts here though. Yes. Yeah, a brief one and like a full-fledged rap song about getting your GED. Yeah. <laughs>
We don't get to play good. nearly what we want to be able to play of this. So we don't yeah. get claimed. But wow, this song is a journey. Two full verses. And I can imagine the commercial from the audio, which is something new. Yep, every single time. Uh, yeah. She's got the little tray. With the, book, with the angle, like up here. Uh -huh. Like For some reason, I always remember the mustard. Like yep. she has mustard. She's got the mustard yeah. and ketchup. Yeah. yeah. Unbelievable commercial. So it's just a story of somebody who went to high school, yeah. didn't do great, <laughs> and then it kind of goes from there. Yeah. Red Robin. Yum. Seems like the Ricoli guys got mm -hmm. like a another gig. Yeah, <laughs> totally. Yeah, but this has like some sort of weird, I don't know, there's some kind of like immaculate spiritual vibe to this one. Yeah. yeah. It seems like a genie is singing it in a certain way to me. But that being said, I'd much rather hear an infomercial rap song about getting your GED. Absolutely. Uh, <laughs> yeah, that's true. I'd have to agree. Red Robin's awesome though. It's like one of those chains that'll hang like pictures of local sports teams in it. Yeah. It'd be like the I high school it. girls soccer team that won states last year. That's up. And you're like, what the fuck? Why <laughs> <laughs> like, why has Red Robin got this here? They like laminate baseball cards on the table, but it's like baseball cards of you. Yeah. <laughs> and you're like, what? Why yeah. am I how? I don't even play a sport. <laughs> Welcome mean. back, buddy. And I'm like, jeez. <laughs> like, you want fries? You want more fries? We have more. They're bottomless. <laughs> we have more in the back. All right, now we got Baby Bottle Pop versus Huggies. Baby uh, stuff. Yeah. yeah, baby stuff here. In the baby zone, yeah. Yeah. Here's a little uh, trivia for you, Gabby. Oh. One of these was saying about the Jonas Brothers. Guess which one? Baby Bottle Pop. Yep. Let's go. They came to my local mall once before they were famous. A mall gig? Yeah, it was awesome. Oh, that is so awesome. So did One Direction. Wow. It was great. Must be a cool ass mall. It was an okay mall, <laughs> but it was great. You know who came to our mall growing up? Who? Guy with a knife. Yeah. It was bad. Yeah. Like Terrible one those, performance. One of those infomercial guys that like. No. Oh, no, 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 no. This was a guy who was, as they say in the business, brandishing a knife. Yeah. Running around with a knife going, oh, I'm going to get you. And then, oh. uh, yeah, it was, yeah, it was That's a not, nice small experience. Yeah, it was bad. For Halloween? Just in no. all times of the year? Middle of summer. Yeah. Good. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. yeah. Worst part was then awesome. they started closing the mall early. Right. Oh, no. So we had to go earlier, the guy with the knife. He's a little sleepy. <laughs> Get over here. I'm going to go to Caribou for coffee <laughs> first. <laughs> then I'm going to try to stab. Baby bottle pop, baby bottle pop. You can lick it, shake it until you get it. Oh, wow. Jonas Brothers has my heart and I will not let go. Nick Jonas tells me I can suck it. I'm going to. <laughs> <laughs> That's post-purity ring, Jonas Brothers, right there. Yeah. That's what I'm True. About. Yeah. I'm with it. I, this one has the, uh, such an edge. You don't get this kind of edge in a commercial, a jingle, you know? It's reminiscent of uh, Suck em Boopers. You know? Even this has more. You don't get a voice that's like, baby bottle pump, baby bottle pump. You know, like he's really like up there with it. Yeah. Back in yeah. the throat. I love Joe Jonas' is like, baby bottle. Like he has that little like grace note when he goes into something. Mm -hmm. Totally like, grace note, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Mommy. Where's the mommy wow? I didn't Where know that, that was ever in it. I just either. know, I'm a big kid now. I don't even Me think too. it had the same rhythm as the yeah. one I know. No, wow. <laughs> That's alternate version. You know what's funny to me? Xylophone, baby instrument. Yeah. yeah. It's always in baby stuff. It's just Why? Doo -doo 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 -doo, like Rugrats theme song mm -hmm. and shit. They're always just like, yeah, babies yeah. can play this instrument. But what? never the steel drum. Why is it just xylophone? <laughs> yeah, that is like, interesting. Why, like, why just, You're right. Yeah. Why not the steel drum where you also hit stuff? Yeah. It's never like, a theremin. No, no. Never. It's like, I'm a big kid. Do -do 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 now. That's a Phil Collins extended cut. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> I don't know where to go with this We have one. real musicians I'm, at play I'm here. I'm Baby Bottle Pop yeah. all the way. I'm the all Jonas the way. Brothers are real musicians. Fuck yeah, they, they are. are. I know yes, they, they are. are, but like compared to like, you don't think the big kid now? Like, mommy, wow. Whatever. Come on. Yeah. <laughs> if I don't have to hear the word mommy again today, I'm good with that. <laughs> all right, now we got uh, last one on this side. Pillow Pets versus Meow Mix. Meow Mix. Oh, okay. <laughs> They knew how lazy they knew how lazy the writing was that at the end they're like just throw it in just, just well, boom boom no it's not over it's not over guys it's I not just it at all. It's it's a, it was done it's yeah. a studio drummer they're like all right all we need is it's a pillow it's a pet it's got shades on it's like <laughs> <laughs> it's a pillow it's a pet it's a pillow pet. Boom, boom, boom. <laughs> da, 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 da. Bum, 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 bum. Meow, 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 me
maybe the most wow. annoying one so far. I love it, but it's annoying yeah. on purpose. I just realized that it's a person singing that. <laughs> it's not a cat that they just pitched. I, mean, I was going to say, you, you know? could just get one meow. And yeah, then... you could get one meow and then pitch the it. Cat's meow doesn't it. sound like meow. <laughs> it, yeah, but, no, it, it totally does. I've heard a cat meow. Yeah, a cat's meow sounds like, like meowing. No. Meow. That's pretty good, but that's like a that's like a feral alley cat. Yeah, <laughs> you need like a proper cat. Yeah, oh. a sophisticated domestic cat will say meow. Hello, meow. That's a cat from the south. <laughs> <laughs> meow mix. That's where I'm going. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I'm just... a pillow pet, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> All right, second side we got. Ooh, Klondike bar. Klondike bar versus Miller Lite. <laughs> Tell wow. me which one I'd rather have right now. <laughs> <laughs> Klondike bar. What? Right. No. no. I fucking we, love drinking Getty. We have White Claws. And I, you, I don't give a shit. I love drinking. You had one coffee. We don't have White Claws. You deleted them. <laughs> I deleted them. <laughs> you delete all six? Fine. No, I deleted she, like three of them. She shotgunned one in the bathroom. She's yeah. Like, she <laughs> what would you do for a Klondike bar? Kill a man. Do I'm a sucker for the woohoos. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I yeah. really like the woohoos. What would you do for a Klondike bar? Woohoo. Like in Sims. You'd woohoo on them for a Klondike bar? No, okay, maybe not on them. Right. Oh, well. That's, that gets a little okay. messy. Yes, <laughs> but. Miller stands clear, beer after beer, if you've got the time. Oh, this oh is shit. Yeah. Yeah. I need a cigar. Yeah. In a fireplace. Yep. In a book. Beer after beer. That would be yeah. the best thing we hear today is that is. descending little yeah. thing. Yeah. Klondike bar is too classic nice. though for me. Yeah. I'm going to have to go with Klondike even I, if it's just a nostalgia thing. If we're going musical, it's Miller time. Beer after. It's like cheers. It makes That's me think true. of like late 70s when I was still young. Right. Yeah. Yeah. yeah I'm going Klondike. Me too. Sorry. Sorry to Lay Miller Lite to rest. A bunch but. of Fugazi alcoholics. All right, now we got K Jewelers versus Ace Hardware. Really juxtaposed here. Yeah, I like that. I like to hit these back to back. Every kiss begins with K. Ding. Was that Lucifer's voice in there? <laughs> <laughs> I've never I picked up on the baritone in that. <laughs> Very ominous. Get married so you can get divorced. Ding. The wave, too. The. At the yeah. end. There's a lot of atmosphere to this one that I never really picked up on, but Perfect. it is just like a, it's a fact. Yeah. Every kiss does begin with K. It does. They sell blood diamonds though, and I love that movie, so it's gonna be hard to beat this one for me. Yep. Adam Sandler. <laughs> Wow, that, that was so wholesome. Yeah, Ace Hardware is just, it's like your neighbor with a tucked in button up shirt that's short sleeve, mm -hmm. it's plaid, For sure, short and sleeve. it's tucked into jeans, <laughs> and he's like watering his garden, but barely even looking. Sure. Kind of just yeah. like whatever. And then he's like, oh, hey neighbor, how are you doing? Very calm demeanor, good energy. Sure. Let you borrow his tools. Whatever, whatever you need. Yeah. <laughs> and then you go over, you shake his hand, and then that song plays in your head. I gotta stand up for independent hardware stores. There's something to be said about like Frank's Hardware in a random town. The walls are full of bolts. There's like oh, an yeah. old lady in there and a schmuck. I mean, yeah, they're doing fine though. I think they'll be all right. I don't know. I think Ace is ruining the heart and soul of this country. I'm going with their jingle though. I'm going to stay out of this politics and go <laughs> with K Jewelers. I'm going K2. K2? Yeah, I'm smoking K2. <laughs> really? Yeah, you Again? Dude, you, that is not a good idea. That stuff care. is really weird. I, I can't believe Ace Hardware lost like that. It's such a wholesome jingle. All right, Toys R Us versus Liberty Mutual. <laughs> <laughs> I remember this lawsuit. <laughs> I do not remember the pacing of wow. that. That yeah. had a real punch to it. Yeah, it was almost like a little hip hop influence in there. Yeah. Yeah. Before I knew it, it was over. <laughs> they are coming back, by the way. The Beastie Boys. Toys R Us. Oh. Actually? Mm -hmm. Just with a few stores or like? Someone bought it during quarantine and now they're going to do like a, it's a whole rebrand and like the store's interactive. Oh, I heard about this. Yeah. yeah. Were stores not interactive before? Like you just had to point and someone <laughs> yeah. would grab the thing for you? Yeah. Liberty, 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 liberty. Just saying the name of your business four times. <laughs> they didn't even say mutual though. Yeah. So it feels just, unfinished. Can you, can you just like logically consistent for like once in your goddamn life, Gabby? Well. Sometimes you want the thing at the end, sometimes you don't. It's just like pick well, one. Well, when So you want, you want it liberty, depends. liberty, 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 mutual. mutual. Like that? Liberty, mutual. Just like. But there was no pizzazz on Hardware. The, they didn't do that. Yeah, but you know, <laughs> sometimes you gotta do it tastefully. It this has to be tasteful. It just depends. Riley, you don't yeah. get it. I knew this was a mistake. The whole thing. You don't, fuck, I just, just move. I can't do this anymore. Just pick one. Then. Just Toys R Us, just because I'm pissed off. Toys R Us, kid. Yeah, it's Liberty for me. Yeah, I'm going with Toys R Us. Thank you. That I'm big, sorry. funky mm -hmm. giraffe. Dr. Pepper versus Subway. It seems to be a Dr. Pepper craze. 
Wow. How does that resolve? <laughs> he's a pepper, she's a pepper, you're a pepper, yeah, yeah. I don't even know where it goes. It led me to nowhere. First soda ever. <laughs> Dr. Pepper? Oh. Really? It was medicine. I like the, the dissonance with the low. Mm -hmm. Yeah, a lot of these it's sound like, more yeah. minor chord than yeah. I remember them. It's very like, interesting. I think in satanic. interesting musically, and it doesn't do anything the other jingles do. Not available anymore. True. Dr. Pepper was better, so <laughs> I'm going with Dr. Pepper. Those are my reasons. Agree to disagree. <laughs> I'm going to go with Dr. Pepper. The $5 foot long one is just kind of a little annoying, slinky little thing. Yeah, it's like something you'd play for like prisoners. Right. You get him to confess. <laughs> sure, yeah. All right, now we got double mint gum versus Kit Kat. Oh, some kicks in there. You don't see gum brands doing this shit. Yeah. Break me off a piece of that. Break me off a piece of that Kit Kat bar. Oh, wow. Cowbell. That one's like I'm yelling for Kit Kats. Yeah. I want one right now. Break me off a piece of that Kit Kat bar. I have yeah. Kit Kats in the freezer. Actually? Yeah, you want one? Kinda. I'll break you off a piece of Let's that Kit Kat. Let's <laughs> no go. Wow, that's... Hey, that's... Whoa! Oh! I thought you were gonna break her off a piece. Why did yeah, you throw what the... Oh! Oh, oh <laughs> shit! Oh! Come on, this one's for me. That well, one's for you. You looked like you were hitting it out of the fuck. Well, I out of the it's... fuck! <laughs> I mean, it's pretty clearly Kit Kat. Here. It's gotta be Kit Kat. It's gotta be, but I really it's appreciate marketing. that resolve too in the double double mint gum. Now we got Mentos versus O'Reilly Auto Parts. More cars. Yeah. Fresh goes better with Mentos fresh and full of life. That's an electric mm -hmm. jingle right there. Thank God this isn't close to Diet Pepsi on here. You know what I mean? You know if you feed seagulls Mentos, their stomachs explode? Yeah, I've done it though, and some of them can handle it. Only a few seagulls exploded? Yeah. That's gotta be a bummer. It's yeah. the ones that hang out in the parking lot and drink all the soda. Yeah. Mm. You give yeah, them Mentos, true. pop like a weasel. Weasels don't yeah. pop either if you give them Mentos, <laughs> which is kind of interesting. Yeah, that's annoying. <laughs> it's interesting. Yeah. Oh, 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 O'Reilly. Auto Parts. Wow. I mean, the, how can you beat that? That bass line's Ow. moving. It's like... Yes. <laughs> O'Reilly's? Oh, yeah. Yeah. I mean, that had sure. everything for we've sure. said we liked about other ones. You know, okay. it has the yeah. note at the end. It's got crazy, unnecessary musicality in it. <laughs> yeah. All right, now we got Juicy Fruit versus Pepto-Bismol. Right. <laughs> That's a funny match. <laughs> Juicy Fruit, the taste, the taste, the taste is gonna move ya. <laughs> Like, wow. It's gonna move ya? The taste, the taste, the taste, the taste, the taste is gonna move ya. <laughs> like, Juicy Fruit is thinking about like what to push to their, like their brand messaging. And they're like, huh. I mean, I know it's sugary gum, but I think mostly what we want to do as a brand is move people. Yeah. Nausea, yeah. <laughs> heartburn, indigestion, upset stomach, diarrhea. Yay, pepto -Bismol. I mean, that's he, easy. You know, if, if the that's baby easy. hadn't been canceled, I think that he would have ended up redoing this one. <laughs> yeah, I can see that. You know what I mean? No, it's your heartburn, not indigestion. Let's go. Like, I could tell go. you. Yeah. Let's go. Let's go. I've never had Pepto. Have you? No, but I, the jingle won me over. I think you I'm going to start using it, even though I don't need it. I don't have problems like you do yeah, with do Kit Kats. You never had upset stomach, diarrhea, nausea, indigestion. heartburn? Indigestion. I just used... Tom's, oh no, competing brand. Now that we're thinking about it, I would like to know what Pepto tastes like. Pink? It, <laughs> I'm gonna go Pepto-Bismol here. Give me the shit. Me too. So now we got Canine Advantix 2 <laughs> <laughs> versus Popeyes. Funny how some of these are crossing over from our fast food bracket. Like it's yeah. funny just to see McDonald's and Popeyes and stuff like, well, did we do this? Yeah. For the package, that's why I'm writing. Canine Advantix quickly stopped all the biting. Why is there a child singing this? It's not a. It's, it's a, a it's puppy. A, it's, a, it's a little dog. It's a little, it's a little dog. Shaver. He goes, yeah. "Hello, mother. Hello, Hello father. father. Flea sticks, mosquitoes. Really bother." They're that's, writing from camp. That's creepy. I don't like it. Oh my god! It, no. I think it's the best. Maybe the best like, of all time. Popeyes is gonna win for me for sure. I haven't even heard it yet. Popeyes is really good. This We're is a fucked up matchup. Chicken for the first from Popeyes, round. right? No, that chicken from Popeyes. Popeyes easy. Now I want a nice little chicken from Popeyes. Louisy and a fast. Don't they say that too? Mm -hmm. That's part of it. I love how it has sure. like the kind of the New Orleans rhythm section. I feel mm -hmm. like I can hear little finger symbols yeah, and like, like spoons mm -hmm. going on. Oh yeah. But it is canine Advantix for me. Really? And it is for me as well. <laughs> if you also like Popeyes like I do, comment below. We will not stand for this. All right, now we got Menards versus Band-Aid. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty awesome. Save big money at Menards. Yes. Wow. Short and sweet. 
<laughs> if I hear somebody just say save, immediately my brain goes, big money at Menard. Like that is, yeah. it's there. It's right at the front of my brain at any moment. Do you know what a pirate's favorite store is? What? Menards. <laughs> <laughs> Arr, you know, it's in there. Minards. <laughs> Minards. <laughs> but what's the joke? Like, it's just you said Minards. I, for, I forgot the joke. The joke's something about his... Uh, his nards. Yeah, his genitals his or something. His minards. I, I cleaned it up for you like, guys. What did, the, what did the pirate say when he sprained his ball sack at the... Don't at say the, ball the, sack. <laughs> Jesus <laughs> Christ, Riley. Such disgusting... Sorry, 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 sorry. sorry. Visceral okay, terminology. All right, hey, listen. Let's, let's do a redo. Okay, yeah, let's wipe sure. the slate clean real quick. Okay. Uh, what did the pirate say when he sprained his scrotum? At the, <laughs> what does Menards do? Hardware? Automotive? They sell it? clothes, beef jerky, <laughs> lumber. I don't know. Well, they have a garden section. Okay. At the strange department store. <laughs> yes. Arr, Menards. No, Menards. <laughs> That's kind of part of a joke. Why does Band-Aid need commercials? People going to get cut. Like, you don't have to convince me. I am back. Oh, Band-Aid back. No, they're copying Huggies. I'm a big kid now. It's the same shit. Why do we need children singing more? I'm tired of the kids. I'm sorry. I was for it at first. Now I don't like it. Because kids be tripping and stuff. Yeah, but just stop. They should have made the kids spit out their yogurt before they sang. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Bush mouth nonsense. Yeah. No, those kids bad. suck. Fuck those kids. Menards, please. Minards. I'm for it. My opinion doesn't matter, but I'm with you, Grant. <laughs> I like the bandits. Home Depot versus Roto Rooter. You're looking to build a back porch. <laughs> <laughs> just a little stock guitar. It's awesome. It just sounds like something from Epidemic Sound. It's just there. Roto Rooter, that's the name. And away go troubles down the drain. Roto Rooter. What the hell? I it's don't know what Roto Rooter is. You don't remember Roto Rooter? Nope. It's like people in a van that pull up with a big snake and they'll like snake their pipe, snake that, your pipes. That has, to, that <laughs> has to be a Michigan thing. I don't know what the no. fuck that is. Roto Rooter. Roto Rooter. <laughs> don't know what the fuck you're talking about. <laughs> Oh, come on, it's Roto Rooter. Roto Rooter. I just I'm, love it because it's a funny thing to say. I'm Home but. Depot. I'm Home Depot all the way. Okay. I'll go Home Depot on it. I'm rooting around, so. Wow. Roto Rooter. <laughs> Farmers Insurance versus Safe Light. Safe Light Replace. We are farmers. Bum, 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 bum. Oh, that's what that is. Yeah. <laughs> okay, gotcha. Safe Light Repair, Safe Light Replace. Oh! I have to. It's just so clean. Yeah, it's like a great mic they used. Yes, it is. <laughs> You're those. <laughs> S's just pour out of her mouth. Yeah. Safe light repair, safe <laughs> light replace. <laughs> is it weird to say Beautiful. that she's hot? Yeah. Probably. It yeah. is weird uh, yeah, to say I wouldn't that. Say shit oh, like uh, that. No, I meant she's probably hot. Oh, <laughs> cool. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes you just can tell. Yeah. Yeah. I'm going to go with the perfect one two punch of safe light repair <laughs> and safe light replace. Yeah. Me yeah. as well. Yeah. We're all in agreement here. Yes. Now we got Manwich versus Skyline Chili. Okay. <laughs> Bet you didn't know Skyline had a jingle, huh? I don't know either of these brands. <laughs> you know, know. Manwich, the canned Sloppy Joe shit? No. I want some fun piled on a bun. I want a man which please. Make tonight a man which night. That's crazy. Yeah, I mean, that's just... <laughs> that's good. I've never heard that in my life. Really? No. Oh, it's got like a whole intro to like, Mama, we don't want this. We want a man which night. It's like, it's crazy. It's like yeah. a guy that walks in your house and sings your mom a song and then she makes you Sloppy Joes. <laughs> wow, that's a good night. Sounds like a cool ass movie from like 2006. Sloppy Joes are the weird is fucking thing. Yeah, it's yeah. ketchup and ground beef, guys. <laughs> That's what you're eating. It's ketchup and ground beef on a bun. That's like a, the most American shit. Mm. That's a gross as fuck. <laughs> yeah. If you eat a sloppy joe around me, I'm going to shoot you in the face with a pistol. <laughs> <laughs> romantic. <laughs> I feel like I'm on a gondola. Yeah, I feel pretty. To that. I'm all for Skyline. I feel like I'm at the top of the Prudential building in Boston and some guy is saying this to me as he's serving me oysters or something. Skyline. <laughs> They'd be serving you oyster crackers because that's what Skyline is. Yeah. They're yeah. serving me oyster crackers It'd be in Cincinnati. It wouldn't be in Boston. <laughs> they don't have them in Boston. Who cares about Cincinnati? Whoa! Whoa. Are you fucking Hot kidding? take? You know who's a big fan of the show? LeBron James. Joe Burrow. Oh, the, the football guy. Joe Shiesty. He, you really, it's like, yeah. you know a lot. <laughs> yeah, that's, I know High Mind's a big sports show, so I yeah. just we, 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 we were going to do the football video with you. We were like, I don't yeah. think Gabby is the chops. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, I don't know. Yeah, the twinkly floating away on a cloud, skyline chili, and like a perfect sleek little dress. I mean, oh my gosh. I love gosh. that for me. I didn't think you'd be able to beat mm -hmm. Manwich either. Man 
which was like weird. Next we got Fanta versus Charmin. Wow. Is that a club mix? I was not expecting that. That's the that. song. That's the original? Yeah. That was actually super crazy. You can hear that out. That's Miami. Yeah. 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 That's the Cleveland at Miami. The yeah. Cleveland, Ohio. Once again, we're back in Ohio. Uh -huh. True. It's more cushiony than ever before. Charmin Ultra less is more. It's the baritone sax that put me off there. That mm -hmm. I'm not so sure it wasn't a tuba. It was a baritone sax. I'm still Fanta. Yeah. Well, Charmin it's puts the bear in baritone sax. Fanta. Fanta. Nice. Fanta. Fanta. All right, now we got Coca-Cola versus Maybelline. Ooh, that's a good one. Coca-Cola has a jingle. What the world wants today is the real thing. This is a song. Where was Coca-Cola? It has nothing to do with Coca-Cola. This was like a 70s or 80s campaign, and it was a real, like, unity vibe. People of all creeds and credences coming right. together, kind of standing on a mountaintop. Yeah. And it was about buying the world a Coke. Oh. Oh, that's kind of cool. I like the buying the world some coke. Yeah, me too. <laughs> yeah, talking about Miami. Oh, yeah. yeah. Okay. Maybe she's born with it. That, what the hell? That version of it yeah, is weird that was crazy. as fuck. Maybe it's Maybelline. That was a Miami cut. <laughs> it was literally beneath like an 80s, like, yeah. <laughs> buried in there. Like, that could be a play at goth night. Maybelline's a classic one, though. Yeah. It is. Maybe it is. it's Maybelline. Frosted Flakes versus Sara Lee. That's just a person. <laughs> yeah. She paid to be on the bracket. <laughs> yeah, we do that on Patreon. If you want to be in the next bracket, just Venmo me $400. Venmo me $390, and I'll put you in there. Venmo me 99 cents. Ah. <laughs> Whoa. Here's the thing about this one. Yeah. As a jingle, it's not that iconic. As a slogan itself, it is. True. Uh, with the more, I don't know. Frosted the, flakes, they're more than good. They're, they're great. Thanks. Sorry, yeah. you should have let you hit the yeah, Tony yeah, you're part. Right. You're right. I'm good at I'm good at Tony the Tiger. What can I say? Maybe go like this to the camera. <laughs> Yeah, that that's was kind of cool. That's good. It's a great jingle. It's a classic. You got the kids singing for the kids cereal, but you also have a full grown Tony. male tiger <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> who is ripped out of his fucking mind and very <laughs> sexual. We were hanging out in West Hollywood yeah. and they would not stop talking about how hot that fucking tiger is. Yeah. I'm not joking. Oh yeah, yeah, with the vlog. With the vlog. Yeah, everyone yeah. was like Tony the Tiger, hottest mascot. Yeah. You grow up eating his cereal, next thing you know, you're, you're an adult, him. then you're eating his ass. Exactly, yeah. yeah. <laughs> his little cat ass that looks like a star. <laughs> it's always, a, it's a gateway drug. Yeah. <laughs> like something, but nobody does it like Sara Lee. Dumb. 50s. I'm over it. Yeah. Yeah. Frosted Flakes. We do the misheard lyrics game sometimes. This is like famously misheard as nobody does it like Sarah Lee. Yeah. Nobody does it like. No, it's nobody doesn't like. That's, so well, that's what, what I thought it said. Someone like. Oh, yeah, yeah. Then you're right. Double negative. So it's doesn't. Yeah. Nobody doesn't. Nobody does not like. Yeah. <laughs> that's a weird one when you think about it. Yeah, it is. Nobody weird. does not like. Mm -hmm. uh, Frosted Flakes, right? Yeah. H&R Block versus Jones Barbecue and Foot Massage. <laughs> okay. Hey, that's something I've heard of. Are you familiar with the second one? Is this another hey, Michigan thing? No, this is a, a viral, a viral sensation. All right, let's do H&R Block first. Let's do our taxes first. Your phone, you don't have to leave home. In person or virtually, Block has your back. That's the jingle? Block got your back. I thought it was, I'm still, I'm still Jenny from the block. I'm not even joking. I thought that they used that for their commercials. Really? They yeah. might have. Jenny from the block, J-Lo. Oh. Are you serious? Oh. Yeah, isn't it that? Are you like a crazed madman who broke out of a hospital you're supposed to still be in? You're telling me J-Lo wasn't a part of the tax people's commercial? <laughs> nope. Okay, well, Jones, please. Barbecue and foot massage. Jones, barbecue and foot massage. You better come down here, get some of this shit. <laughs> <laughs> I do not remember this at all. Yeah, it's a real place. You get him feet massaged and he's got a smoker out back. Can I get mac and cheese? Yeah, I think you had mac and cheese, right? All right, then I'm sold. Show Gabby the commercial. It's like a minute long. Yeah. I think it's yeah. worth it. Ask McDonald's to fry something other than what they normally fry. Guess what you're going to get? Nothing. <laughs> you know, I put it in the fry. Hell, this is a dinosaur. All I need. <laughs> yeah, so. Jones wins. <laughs> it's a dangerous thing to put a meme in here. Yeah. Because we are not going to be able to let anything beat this, I feel like. I mean, it's going up against a sex icon next round, <laughs> so I think it's got a tough matchup. Yeah, All right. It's true. It's true. Let's send it to the second round. Okay, second round. 
Title card. Yeah. There's no title card yeah. for the second round. We're just going to do it. There is now. <laughs> We're just playing it out. No more clips of songs. No more bullshit. Okay. Just absolutely getting fucking cock sucking into it. Okay. okay. <laughs> Let's get cock sucking into it. Sock and boppers versus Oscar Meyer. Cock and boppers. Cock and boppers. Yeah, it's rocking. <laughs> sure. It's a rocking yeah. tune. I'm like Oscar Meyer, which is, I want to be an Oscar Meyer. We, whatever. whatever. We get it. You want wieners. We get it. Children violence. Yeah, we like it. Folgers versus Alka Seltzer. Fuck that little fizzy elf. <laughs> yeah, it's Folgers. <laughs> Yeah, I'm Folgers. Folding for Folgers. Waking up. <laughs> Simping for Folgers. <laughs> Simping for Folgers. <laughs> the General versus Reed Cola. General. Fuck. Oh, this one's fucking Ooh. tough. I'm General. I'm General. Then it doesn't matter, so it's not fucking tough for me, but I like those little Dutch motherfuckers. <laughs> <laughs> oh, too bad. Leave them in Switzerland. Uh, Leave the fugal horn in the last round. Yeah. Uh, Farmers Only versus Stanley Steamer. Easy. Stanley Steamer. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm kind of I'm kind of on steam train. I'm kind of with the steams. So then it, yeah, I mean I don't understand that. Give me the farmers only again. You don't have to be lonely at farmersonly.com. City folk just don't get it. <laughs> okay, and Stanley Steamer is Stanley Steamer, the carpet cleaner. That's right. Wow. What? Honestly, you know what? I'm starting to I'm starting to question this. I don't know. Maybe I, mean, I just don't relate with the farmers. Yeah. Maybe that's why. You're a city girl. I'm a city girl. I'm part of the group. Huh. I'm city girl behavior. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Period. Huh? What if I told you Gabby Bell was the queen of city girl behavior? <laughs> I'm city girls. <laughs> I'm switching. I'm farmers only. You're switching. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. It's just like once I thought about which what the actual jingles were, I just like the steam kind of cleared for me. JG Wentworth versus FreeCreditReport.com. Shit. I'm going with the opera. Yeah. Me I'm going, too. I'm going with the infomercial rap, personally. Mm -hmm. oh, well, it doesn't matter. So <laughs> we outnumbered you. Yeah, yeah, I feel you, and I'm going to miss those little pirate words. playing fox. He kind of looked like Jim from The Office. You guys ever seen that show? <laughs> well, oh, The Office? Yeah. yeah I haven't seen the commercial with the guy that looks like him. Yeah, he's like, uh, what's the show? You've never seen The Office? What's the deal with it? Started yeah. off with Ricky Gervais, and then Americans adapted it. Yeah. Okay. And they put uh, BJ Novak, uh, yeah. Rain Wilson, John Krasinski, Steve Carell. Mindy Kaling. Craig Robinson. Okay. Yeah. From Hathaway. Time machine. Mm -hmm. I mean, I'm sold. I'll watch anything with Blowjob Novak in it. <laughs> <laughs> Now we got uh, Empire Today versus Chili's Baby Back Ribs. <laughs> oh, it's gotta be Baby Back. <laughs> it's gotta be what? Baby Back. You guys are tripping. No. I want my Baby Back, Baby Back, Baby Back, Baby Back. Yeah. Chili's Baby. I didn't baby. hear much soul in there. It's really just Baby Back, Baby Back, Baby Back. I don't know. Makes me want ribs. <laughs> now we got AutoZone versus Education Connection. Education Connection. Come on. It has to be. I like AutoZone, but Education Connection just sticks to my brain cells. Education Connection is a work of art. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it is. All right, now we got Baby Bottle Pop versus Meow Mix. Easy Baby Bottle Pop, Jonas Brothers. You're right, yeah. yeah. I needed reminded of that. I'm annoying of, I'm annoyed by the Mew Mi Meow Mix. Yeah. It's just mm. some girl going meow, 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 meow. Like, she's not Again, even trying to sound like a cat. It's a cat. She's it's not cat. even trying, though. It's a cat, though. That's not what a cat sounds like. What does a cat sound like? Meow, meow. Like she's she's just going meow That's meow really meow meow. No, she's just saying the word meow. You've got to go meow meow meow. Like you have to pretend to be a cat. That's what she did. And she didn't. She probably didn't even put on cat ears. Like you need to get in character. Maybe <laughs> eat a pebble. Cat ears didn't <laughs> exist. <when they> <laughs> <that. laughs> you know what? <laughs> You gotta get in character. Eat a pebble. <laughs> what kind of do you have? <laughs> yeah, it's a baby bottle pop though. Yeah. The meow Mix one just annoys the fuck out of me. That's the thing. Klondike Bar versus K Jewelers. We rode for K in the first round. That's true. That's true. Should we stick to it? What would you do? Oh, that's the ooze. That's right. Ooh. Ooh. I'm a sucker for the ooze. I'll take the Klondike. Klondike. I'll do the Klondike as well. Toys R Us versus Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper. Dr. Yeah, Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper, easily. Dr. Pepper. That one is kind of like a sleeper because nobody remembers that. Right, yeah. it's before but our time. musically. Yeah. Kit Kat versus O'Reilly. O'Reilly. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah it's you're right. Be. Oh, oh, oh. O'Reilly's oh, kick at suck. <laughs> Pipto Bismol versus K9 Advantix 2. I can't believe it's K9 Advantix 2. Yeah. You know? Two. I am going to go K9 Advantix. Give me the shit syrup. Yep. Me too. Pepto <laughs> over like I, an amazing little golden retriever singing a song about camp. Yeah. I'm, I'm annoyed at the children singing the songs. Yeah. We're enough. over kids. Hello, mother. Hello, father. No, too scary. Mosquitoes. No. Really, father? 
What do you mean? No, that's Before fucking that terrifying. Thing. All right, Pepto. I used to pour Pepto up when I couldn't afford drop. I'd rather pour up Pepto than green, I'll tell you that yeah, much. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> better than blue. Yeah. Yeah. Now we got Menards versus Home Depot. Home Depot. Kind of a battle of the same store. <laughs> um, it's Menards. <laughs> Say big. It's versus classic. Bounce. I like the Home Depot, like Home Depot too. Depot. This is crazy. I like Say the Home Depot. big money at Menards. Yeah. Whatever, Home Depot, I guess. Yep, Depot Home wins. Depot. Home Depot. Safe Light versus Skyline Chili. That Skyline song That's was beautiful. It was beautiful. Twinkle, Twinkle, Little Star. Oh my God. It's actually nice. little keys in it. Yeah, I feel like this is an upset. Yeah, this is an upset. Yeah. yeah. And Skyline went very far in our fast food bracket. Nobody knew what it was. Yeah. And they were criticizing us, but we're just repeating Here we history. Are. Yeah. Here yeah. we go. Skyline Chili. Stand up, Cincy. Fanta versus Maybelline. Fanta. Yeah. Give me the club banger. Yeah. The only <laughs> club banger on this bracket. <laughs> and we're back here. Frosted Flakes versus Jones Barbecue and Foot Massage. I'm sorry. I don't care how fucking hot that tiger is. I don't care how shredded and yoked he is. The perfect combination of both. Yeah. That's not going to sway my thing from being Jones Barbecue Foot Massage because of the comedy element. I love like the, the jubilation of it's more than good. <laughs> it's great. Yeah. I kind of, I'm going with the tiger. No. I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. Tony's gonna win for me. Sweet 16, we got Sock and Boppers versus Folgers. Sock them Bops. It's Folgers, me. easily. It's oh. Folgers, yeah. Oh, my heart. You said you'd fold for Folgers. Yeah, that was a joke. Oh. It's just a bit. I don't like coffee. Who cares about coffee? The General versus Farmers only. General. Farmers. Farmers. Yeah. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, oh Gavin's oh, getting trounced. Gavin's getting absolutely steamrolled this round. Final fours. <laughs> All right, now we got J.G. Wentworth versus Chili's Baby Back Ribs. Give me that <laughs> old ass opera, Ooh. that church opera. I'm riding with my soul soul guys. You're going with the baby back again? Oh, no. Oh, I no, want it's up to my me. baby back, baby back. Baby Listen, back. I want my baby back too, but I mean, not, not enough to pick these ribs. Barbecue sauce. I have to go with JG. That's fair. I have to. That one should go on. Now we got Education Connection versus Baby Bottle Pop. Baby Bottle. Yeah, Sticking give me the, with the Joe Bros. The Joe Bros. Actually, yeah. yeah. It's close though. I really like it's the story close. of Education Connection. Me, me too. too. Yeah. Everybody loves like a success like a comeback tale. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Now we got Klondike Bar versus Dr. Pepper. Dr. Pepper. Yeah, give me that pepper, pepper jingle. It's just too crazy. And it's it nostalgia for a time I don't even remember. Yeah. Yeah, for the record, I was going to pick Klondike Bar just because I feel like that is so classic. Mm -hmm. Like, if I said I was doing this to my family, like my extended family, my uncles would be like, oh, Klondike, Klondike Bar. Bar. They'd be like, yeah. what would you do for a Klondike Bar? I, would, I wouldn't give up my guns, but basically everything else. <laughs> I would evade my taxes. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> O'Reilly Auto Parts versus Pepto-Bismol. Oh, really? Yeah, oh, O'Reilly. It's gotta yeah. be. Sorry, shit cream. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Home Depot versus Skyline. Fuck. It's Skyline. Uh, but it's Why are we simple. riding for this stupid little guitar riff? Because it's, <laughs> it's so generic that it's memorable. Yeah. Uh, there's a million things that sound like it. It's it actually an insult to say that something sounds like that jingle. It makes me want to put on boots and get in the yard, though. I want to get stung by wasps. You want to get stung by wasps? Stung by wasps as I'm gardening. Yeah. I woke up to a wasp in my room the other day. That's how I woke up to the buzz of a wasp. That mm -hmm. is awful. Yeah, I'm allergic to wasps. wasps. Oh no, you're yeah. allergic to everything. <laughs> yeah, I know. I'll take Skyline, better song. Fine, oh, I will God. agree. Fine. <laughs> and we don't even have to talk about this Fanta. one. Fanta. Club Fanta. banger. Yeah, Fanta. DJ, play that shit again. <laughs> cool, now we are in our Elite Eight. This is crazy. It's Elite. Yes. <laughs> Folgers versus Farmers Only. <laughs> Fuck. God damn. I'm going Folgers on this one. More classic. I'm going Farmers Only. Oh no, I don't like either of them. Farmers. <laughs> yes! Love wins, baby. All right, J.G. Wentworth versus Baby Bottle Pop. I think this is where the Jonas Brothers kind of met their match. I know, this is this is a rough one. I'm going Baby Bottle Pop on this one. Really? I don't know, it just has that like, something about that little hook. Mm -hmm. I'm, 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 I'm remembering that one more. The J.G. Wentworth one is kind of scary. Pop. Victorian. Baby Bottle Pop. Baby Bottle Pop. Okay. You won me over. Baby Bottle Pop. Baby Bottle Pop. <laughs> Gotta get like the, I'm almost throwing up. Baby Bottle Pop. Yeah. Baby Bottle Pop. <laughs> Like that. Yeah, it's so good. Dr. Pepper versus O'Reilly. It's O'Reilly easily for me here. <sighs> I think Dr. Pepper's run is over. Yeah, I was kind of leaning towards O'Reilly. Cinderella story, for sure, that Dr. Yeah. Pepper was there. Yeah. Everybody respects them for being in the Sweet 16, but everybody meets their match eventually. Sometimes you just for get overwhelmed gone. by the talent. Mm -hmm. Exactly. Yeah. Skyline versus Fanta. 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 
Fanta. This side's stacked. That's yeah. fantastic. <laughs> All right, now we got our final four. Final four. Okay, I'm moving these down here. We can zoom in on this. Gonzaga. That's the one. Uh, that's the school I was thinking. There you of. go. No, Zagnus. Washington. Yeah, there we go. Final four. We got Farmers Only versus Baby Bottle Pop. Baby Bottle Easy. Yeah, Baby Bottle Pop. Yeah, Those it's the, it's the right winner. Farmers made it far enough for me to go to sleep tonight. All right, Baby Bottle Pop goes to the final. Who's it facing? We got the two huge number one seeds right here. We got O'Reilly Auto Parts versus Fanta. It's Fanta for me. Oh. I'm going O'Reilly with this one. Oh, not again. I think it's just a classic jingle. Like, it feels more like a jingle. Fanta, I'd rather hear in the club, for yeah. sure. That is true. Actually, no, that's not true. If I was in the club and all of a sudden it went, oh, oh, <laughs> I would lose my shit. Yeah, no, I'm O'Reilly all the way. No matter where Shit. I am. I'm going Fanta. It's more fun. It's up to you, Gabby. That's what you get when you come on this channel. You I signed up for this. Fuck. It feels like I'm choosing between a parent. A parent choosing between kids or you're choosing No, like like my parents are divorced and I have to choose which one to go with. This right. is what it feels like. I would just tell one that they're my favorite and the other one that they're my favorite to try and to get the best presents. They'll never know. But this one, like one is clearly winning. So yeah. I have to choose one. That's true. Right. And you're on TV. O'Reilly. Let's do it. It has to be O'Reilly. It's, so it's as a jingle, jingle jungle, O'Reilly's got the dongle. All right, here we go. This is our final oh, right here. Baby Bottle Pop final. versus O'Reilly Auto Parts. I am putting a poll <laughs> up in the chat right now. You guys are going right to vote mm -hmm. on what your favorite jingle is. Also, comment your actual favorite jingle. Say, hey, this one should have won. You guys are bozos. Gabby did not fit well on the channel. Say yeah, stuff like that sucks in the comments. so bad. <laughs> you know what I mean? Stand up for Popeyes if you're with Gabby on that one, yeah, too. Popeyes, yeah, Popeyes, rise up. <laughs> All right, let's go down the line. Brayden, who are you picking here? I I'm, I just voted against it, but I'm going with O'Reilly. Gabby, where are you standing? Baby bottle. Joe Bros all the way. Comes down to me. Mm -hmm. Yep. You guys know where I'm going. Oh, 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 oh O'Reilly. <laughs> Savage. Auto parts. Wow. O'Reilly Auto Parts is the winner of the commercial jingles bracket. Everybody let us know your favorite jingles down in the comments. Let us know what brackets we should do next. We want to thank Gabby Bell for being here. Thanks, Gabby. Thank you, Gabby. You're so welcome. Everybody go check out Gabby's channel. She is one of my favorite YouTubers. I love her videos. You should go subscribe and check out her stuff. Thanks. Other than that, make sure you like the video, subscribe, all the stuff I said at the beginning, and great, and please leave those wonderful people with some advice to leave or live their lives by. It's the problems in someone's life that make the person. All right, this has been High My TV. We love you, appreciate you, and we'll see you in the next one. Bye. <laughs> I would drink a glass of gasoline if you handed it to me. Yeah. <laughs> That's how much I love the smell. Do you guys add sugar to your cereal? No. As kids? No. Oh, I used no to get, if I ever had Rice Krispies, big tablespoon of sugar. You are exactly the type of person who would do that. <laughs> <laughs> Box of sugar. That's why I used to eat candy. Like yeah. I don't eat candy at all. Never added sugar to anything in my life, I yep. don't think. Jingle bell, jingle bell, jingle bell rock. Yeah, Rocking and rolling. <laughs> I take a stroll. <laughs> oh. Me and Santa were changing. Drinking some beers. <laughs> Call 1 800 Bud Light today. <laughs> okay. Oh, yeah. Good. Your last name's Balls? Yeah. Oh, that's it's, awesome. You know, my dad's Mr. Balls, <laughs> Mrs. Balls. I got a great story about John Hamm later. Remind me to tell okay. you. Okay. <laughs> I'm excited to hear it. <laughs> and when they take it down half an octave, the second part with that fifth note. Yeah. And the. The treble clef and all that sort of shit. Right. It's pretty cool. It's no, it's no, he's... It's Baby bottle pop. Like, good. the way they do that, they, they stretch out that B major. Mm. They stretch out that B major, it's you a B know? Major. It's a, and it's a relief note, too. B major. That's what's so four. cool. Yeah, that's there's what's a cool. There's note. a relief note. A grace there's note a and a relief, relief note. And that's you, yeah. so true. That's and the like, major yeah. seventh. The major. Diminished. Oh, dude, <laughs> no, that seventh was major. <laughs> so Holy shit, yeah. Yeah, totally cool stuff. I'm kind of I'm a bit of a nerd with this. I, I'm a bit of a nerd. Yeah, but we're a bit of a you know Charlie Puth over here. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, it's okay. yeah, yeah, mm -hmm. yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's listen to mm -hmm. a baby sing about the pants it shits. In. Yeah. <laughs> David Spade is short and dumb. <laughs> Peyton Manning sang that at the roast of whoever he roasted on Comedy Central. I thank you, Hank. Wow. Yeah.